Well, let's move straight on with our next idea, which comes from Sheerness on Sea in Kent, in the brain of Richard Jeffries. <laughs> Dear genius, many of us have suffered the tragedy of a child's tears following the unexpected loss of a much-loved pet. The real victims of this situation, of course, are the parents. We have to scour the local pet shops in search of an identical substitute quickly before the child returns from school. To alleviate this torment, I propose that when you buy a pet for your child, such as a hamster, gerbil, it comes with a simple, all-in-one, zip-up fursuit. Then, when it dies, you simply unzip the suit, take out the expired creature, pop in any replacement, zip it up. Hey! The child will never know. Clearly popular in the room, Johnny. <laughs> Don't tell the kids. Because, you know, the British public are famous for their love of cruelty to animals. Um, <laughs> are, you a, are you a pet lover? I am, yeah. It's an, awful, um, it's an awful thing to explain to a child, isn't it? It's, it's a terrible... And the beauty of this is you can put any pet in the zip-up suit. You get to the pet shop, he hasn't got any mice, put a gerbil in. Hasn't got any gerbil, put a hamsters in. Yeah, it kind of runs out when you go, put a cat in. <laughs> Get a tarantula, okay? One or two legs too many, snip them off, put them in. Scruffy's on the ceiling. <laughs> it works. I think you haven't got a cat, put <laughs> 10 million ants in. Oh. <laughs> what happens when the hamster wants to go back and visit relatives? He's changed. <laughs> oh, since he's been in la -de -da London, look at him. <laughs> I've got one here. We, we've had one made. Um, you know, nice zip-up suit. I could... <laughs> Uh, for the sake of, uh, just to explain, we have put eye holes in. I'll just poke the pencil through. Oh! You can see, right. so it can, you know, it would be able to look through the eye holes. It's even got pore holes. If I can just get that through. It's a bit of a tight squeeze, admittedly, but they do come through like yeah, so. So, yeah, that, you know, if, if the, the hamster if, can... If they're hungry, they'll work it out. Yeah, they? yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> this is a nice little cute hamster. Unzip it. Looking... Right, now. Okay. Now, look now, at his markings. You show him that. And you've got to go through the whole rigmarole of going, do you want to go to a fancy dress party? <laughs> OK, well, let's see if he does want to go to a fancy dress party. OK, let's have a, let's have a go at this, OK? I'm just going <laughs> to... <laughs> it's a tight squeeze, it's not... Dave, we've had very full careers. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just, I'll be honest, it's, it's not very comfortable viewing, so I'll just... Get down here and take the lid off and if we... Okay. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah. Nice. That's a perfect transformation, isn't it? I mean. <laughs> As you can see, no discomfort whatsoever. And the zip is hidden zip. completely, yeah, yeah, it tucks yeah. in. Okay, now unzip him. Do you want. <laughs> <laughs> if you want me to unzip him, I will. No, I'll do it. It's all right. <laughs> now, th well, this is one of the problems. What happens yes. if your child sees yes. the zip and thinks it's like a Russian doll? But it's, just, yeah, but it's, it's just like every other toy. It's got, it's all got a zip up the front. It's like Barbie. It's like Action Man. It's, it's great because it fits right in with what they already know. I think you've mistaken a hamster with a hot water bottle. <laughs> <laughs> that could work. I'm now, telling you, I woke up and I was beige. <laughs> You've had stranger days, come on. You know. <laughs> Johnny, it's decision time. The pet zip suit, is it genius or not? Genius. 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 It's got its flaws. <laughs> I won't deny. And the idea of this becoming a global success and you actually having money scares me. But the gem is the idea I kind of like, so... Um, it's red for it's, not genius and white for as genius. As long as he can... I know, but I just like playing games with people's <laughs> emotions. Um, I actually think it's genius.